Robin FC TV with Adam Hinchwood following a 2 0 defeat to Oxford City in the playoff semi final. Uh, how are you feeling after that? Um, yeah, obviously, you know, massive disappointment. Um, but I think all in all, you know, we'll give credit to the opposition today. The, the better team won. Um, I thought they was, you know, better in a lot of areas. And uh, the first half won it for them. Um, you know, but I'd just like to say full credit to, to the players. I think they, they gave their all. And, you know, the support we brought here today, it felt like a, a bit of a league game and a, a, league, a league following in that corner. It was, it was um, you know, really was second to none and it's been brilliant all season. And yeah, we're obviously disappointed with the first half. Um, but like I say, we, all we asked at half time was the players to leave everything out there and they definitely did that. Um, you know, every single one of them give their all and it just wasn't to be. It really felt like the effort was there, especially in the second half. The way the players were working and chasing every ball, it felt like they really wanted it today. No, it did, yeah. And, um, you know, we probably has a great chance. Um, first minute again, one-on-one. -on -one, uh, you know, and maybe I think on the day that was the difference. Um, you know, the lads got it and Toe poked one home on the edge of the box with three players around him. And just that bit of, bit of extra quality I thought they, they, they possessed today. Um, but. I'd say today's not a day to um, take anything away from our players. Um, you know, every single one of them has, has given their all um, and got us this position. And we're just really disappointed that we couldn't have had a home time in the final. Um, but like I say, there can't be no complaints. Uh, they was definitely far superior than us. I'd definitely be speaking on behalf of the fan base that what an incredible achievement has been. First season at this level ever. To achieve what we've done this year, to get into the semi final. Um, Play the way we've played as well, and not sold our integrities or our values. It's been a remarkable achievement. Yeah, it has yeah. Um, that sort of won't sink in just yet. I think we'll obviously just be disappointed that we couldn't have gone one step further. Really, um, you know, I definitely feel there was. I thought we got the ball into the final thirds a lot, and our quality today was was lacking, and um, that was the di biggest disappointment I think um, today. Just lacked a bit of quality. So, yes. There's some lots of plaudits come our way for our first season and stuff like that, but you know, over the course of the season, maybe there's been three teams that have been better, better than us, Everfleet and, and Oxford, definitely been two. Um, so, you know, it evens itself up, you're hoping for a bit of luck and you can get one over on them on this off day, like St Albans have with Dartford. And, you can go on to the final, but let's like say it was full of endeavour, and it's all you can ask them. We just left a bit of quality. And we touched upon the support and the, uh, the numbers of support, so 550 sell out in the away area. Yeah. Uh, says all you need to know about the way this team's engaged the town in the football club. No, it's been it's been unbelievable, really. It's my first sort of taste of, of playoffs as a manager, and no, I absolutely loved it, to be honest. It's like having a little tournament at the end of the season, and like I say, the whole, the whole, the whole town was, was galvanised for a spell. Um, you know, just on the way to school, you're getting people to the ER and speak to you in shops, and you know, like I really felt it living in Worthing. Um, really felt the whole town get behind us, and it's, it's been nice. And like I say, just really disappointed for everybody that we, we can't maintain it and keep going because it was a great feeling. But the season isn't over yet. We've got Thursday, the Sussex Senior Cup final at the Amex. How are you feeling going into it and what place to, to showcase the season and end it? No, yeah, this one's going to be another tough game. Um, you know, we didn't want our season to end today and it wasn't going to end either way because of that game. So, yeah, we've got to, got to galvanise everyone, um, have a good training session on Tuesday and, and one last push and one last bit of effort and endeavour from everybody uh, for Thursday. And, yeah, we... Um, we, we lacked some quality and didn't showcase ourselves brilliantly last season. So I'm hoping that desire is there, the same one that I've got, to try and put that right. And um, yeah, to lift the, the Sussex Senior Cup, I've not done it as a, as a manager yet, so it'd be a nice thing to do. And I, and I think like for the players as well, like it's got to be, got to be our, our aim and our target now. But like I say, it's, it's going to be no easy one. It's, it's a brilliant game for the fans again, local derby, you know, the, the popular supporters will get behind them. and. Worthing fans will be there in the full colour and numbers and you know, it'll be a great game to be a part of and yeah, we're just hoping we can, can give a good account of ourselves. Thank you Adam. That's all, cheers.